welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to do a one brand tutorial with the brand Jane Iredale and uh, this brand is uses a lot of minerals in their makeup so it's very natural and very light on the skin and it's also called the skincare makeup so it's supposed to be very good for your skin. So um, yeah and I'm really excited to try this out because I have tried a lot of products from Jane Iredale like the, the loose mineral powder is very good and like the bronzers are amazing. I think they look so natural and glowy. So I'm really excited to try more products out and um, yeah I wanted and I also wanted to make this look really natural and wearable for all you guys who don't like all the crazy glam and stuff like that. So if you want to see how I got this look right here just keep watching. So now I'm going to quickly do my brows with this little guy right here. This is the eyebrow pencil in the color Dark Brunette and oh my gosh, I love this eyebrow pencil. It is so like, I don't know if you can see it, but it's really like tiny at the top here. So it's really easy and you have a lot of control and I just really love it. So I'm just going to go ahead and do my brows real quick and um, yeah. And that's it for the one brow. I know my brows are a little bit bushy right now. I haven't plucked them, but whatever. Okay, so once my eyebrows are done, I'm just gonna go ahead and jump right into eyeshadow and I'm gonna use this eyeshadow thingy right here. It's called Eye Steps and it's in the color Go Warm. And as you can see, it kind of like turns out like that and uh, like this, so it's really cool. And I'm gonna grab this shade right here. This is the lightest one and I'm gonna use this to set my eyelids. And then I'm gonna grab this pinky peachy eyeshadow and I'm gonna use this in my crease. And I'm actually gonna go ahead and focus this eyeshadow mostly on the outer part of my eye, but also kind of drag it inwards as well, if that makes sense. Oh my gosh, it blends so nicely. I love it. So next up, I'm gonna grab this shade right here and I'm gonna apply this mostly in my outer V. And a lot of you guys are asking me what kind of brushes I use and I mostly use Zoeva brushes. These ones are the uh, Lux Rose Gold brushes, but I do have like the normal ones as well, the black and the silver, and this one is just like rose gold. But these brushes are so good and they're really affordable and I just, I love them to death. I think they're so good and they're basically the only brushes that I use. I just think they're amazing. But yeah, now I'm going to go ahead and do my eyeshadow and I'm just going to go ahead and place this in my outer V. So I think that's enough and then I'm just going to go ahead and blend it out with a fluffy brush. This one is the Inglot 6SS brush. It's really big, so... And now I'm gonna go ahead and grab the gel liner in the color Espresso and I'm just gonna do a little wing with this. So as you probably can tell, it's just like a really soft eyeliner. It's not black, it's just kind of like this brownish color. And then I'm just gonna go ahead and curl my lashes because this look, I'm not gonna use false eyelashes. I want this look to be as simple as possible. And uh, yeah. And for mascara, I'm gonna go ahead and use this one right here. This one is in the color Jet Black. And I'm just gonna go ahead and coat my upper lashes with this. This mascara is so soft, like it's not stiff at all, like the brush, it's really soft. To highlight underneath my eyes, I'm going to use this one right here. This one is called Active Light Under Eye Concealer. And I'm just going to go ahead and apply this right underneath my eyes to highlight and uh, yeah. And 
And I'm also gonna do a little thingy up on my forehead right here. Just to highlight a little bit there as well and the tip of my nose. Then I'm just gonna use my beauty blender to blend everything out. And then to set my face, I'm gonna use the Loose Mineral Powder in the color Warm Sienna. And I'm just gonna grab a little bit and then just powder it underneath my eyes. So I'm gonna use this bronzer right here to bronze up my face and this one is in the color So Bronze 2. And yeah, I'm just gonna go ahead and apply this all around my face, like around my forehead, around like my cheeks, and, well not around my cheeks, but like on the outer part of my cheeks, if that makes sense. And this bronzer has a little bit of shimmer in it, so you're gonna look really um, bronzy and glowy and just beautiful. So next up, I'm gonna apply some blush and then I'm gonna use this one right here. This one is actually a bronzer and it's in the color Sunbeam. I don't know if you can tell, but it gives like this beautiful glow too. And then for lips, I'm gonna use this lip product right here. It's called Lip Fixation and it's actually a this part is actually a lip stain and this is the lip gloss so you use both of them and this one is in the color fetish i think yeah there it is so i'm just gonna go ahead and apply the stain first and then the lip gloss after <laughs> it looks so weird when you when i don't do my upper lip <laughs> And then I'm gonna go ahead and apply the lip gloss. And then last but not least, I'm gonna go ahead and spray my entire face with this uh, finishing spray. It's called Pomist and it literally smells like pomegranate. I love it so much, it smells so good. And this spray just kind of helps all the powders settle nicely into the skin and look like skin. <laughs> so yeah, this is the finished result. And as you can see, I used a lot of soft tones on my eyes and I didn't do like a really uh, a sharp eyeliner. I used like a kind of like a softer color, like brown instead of black. And um, I didn't contour or anything, I just bronzed up my face to make it look really glowy and natural and that's what I was going for. I wanted to do like a very simple and easy look for you guys because I know a lot of my looks uh, include a lot of like heavy contour and like really sparkly eyes or like bold lips and stuff like that so I just wanted to do something really simple because I know a lot of you guys have been asking for that so and this look is completely wearable you can go to school to work to a party with this and you won't look crazy for those of you who don't like all the crazy glam and stuff like that and um, yeah um, and also since I use Jane Iriel which is like only mineral makeup and makeup that is good for your skin I just wanted to do a look that is really natural and really light on the skin and that you don't look that you look healthy so yeah that's what I was going for and I really hope you enjoyed this look give it a thumbs up if you want more of these uh, simple and natural looks and I'll do more of those and yeah thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time bye guys